everybody here for the whole weekend. Yes. I'll watch you. Me? Today. 6.50. Out of here. Oh, yeah. I do. I go quick. I move it every year. Is there anything you wish you could see? You know, I, I don't see any. Like, I just come and go. Like, I never sort of stick around because we're always so crazed in production that we're like, you have to get back right away. Yeah. Um, this year's actually the first year that we aren't like we're like actually ahead for the it's like it's just like we don't know what to do with ourselves. So I should have stayed for like a while, but then like but there's a few things out there. Um, it's, I don't know, there's friends, I have friends that come with, you know. Some of the Berlanti people have a lot of friends in the Berlanti camp, so I, I didn't just know anyway. anyway. Scorpio. So both seasons ended with Walter driving a car. Yes. So what's up with Walter and cars? I don't know. I think <laughs> we like cars. I like cars, and I, and, and I don't mean to put it in there, but I always, and I just, it, like, the first season was, I don't know if the second season was my idea, the first season was absolutely my idea. Yeah. Like, I wanted, very early on, about, about a third of the way through the season, I was like, I've got an idea for the ending of the end of the season. He's going to drive a Ferrari or a Lamborghini, whatever it's going to be, and it's going to drive off a cliff, and they're going to have to. Just, I want to see him go off a cliff in a front. That was it. <laughs> we made an episode out of it. But maybe cars are like his E that's going I think so. Ride, I think right? it's, I mean, I'm a, I'm, I like cars. I've always liked cars, and I think there's something I like fast. Cars, <laughs> It's so boring to so many people. <laughs> but I like fast sports cars and and it's there's like there's such great machines. Like they're just these mechanical marvels to me. Um, and the opportunity to put you know, and I, the idea of somebody being so sort of staid and stiff in his life, but then you put him behind the wheel and he's just sort of a terror. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm talking about myself. I don't know. That was, I really did enjoy it. I love that. What can you tell us about the upcoming season? Um, it's, it's better than season two. I honestly feel like I, there's so much stuff that we came out of the box with. Um, there's so much more personal material that is like, I mean, there's the happy, who's happy, married to, what's going to happen when he gets up to like, when, when Walter gets to Tahoe. I mean, this is, this is stuff that is going to reverberate throughout the whole season. And we just, we took what we, you know, so many of the lessons of season two, which we, those were our best moments. Those personal story moments were our best stuff. And when we came out of hiatus this year, we had about, you know, a few weeks off. We came out swinging, and we wanted every character to have, to have real arcs, and not just an arc, but really have more stuff going on. And so every episode, like the most emotional episodes that we did last year, we're trying to make that the norm for every episode this year. And still have our adventures and still all do the stuff that we always do. Which is also, we have such we have really cool, cool, cool things coming up. We're so excited about it. Um, Walter gets blasted into space. We're going to tell you, that's all I'm going to tell you. That's all I'm saying. And it's, it's easily one of our best of all time. It's going to be one of our best. It's our best, one of our best scripts. You're just like, you read it in your life. Great. Like, I, honestly, I look at it and I'm going, how are we going to do this? Well, we're going to do it. It's going to be great. Okay. Are we going to get answers about Happy's marriage like, right away? Or is it going to be something you're going to draw out? It's going to be a couple. Um, I won't tell you exactly when. It's not going to be one. It's not going to be ten. It's going to be, we're going to we're gonna get it out uh, a few episodes. Um, and then we're going to see it reverberate for a while. That's going to be a piece of information that's going to, you know, it's going to be a big thing that's going to, we're going to have to work through for a while throughout the season. Um, because it's just, it's going to be crazy. It's, it's not going to expect you. No one tell you. But it's really, it's a really fun one. It's a great sort of, it's a great turn for our team and something that, again, is going to sort of shake them up. Uh, what's the dynamic like on the team this season? Because we saw relationships on the team here and now he's the one going on yes you know he's sort of you know they're always they're sort of for each other they're always ports in a storm you know they're 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 unto them so they're like they're their own protection and that will never change i think that's the thing that people come to see with the show is that they really they care about you know the, the unity of this team is so important to them. but they really are thrown into a lot. They're, they're each sort of personally into a lot of turmoil that we haven't seen yet. Especially the happy character. We'll see her struggling with sort of besides the fact that she's married. There's a whole other storyline that we have planned for. We have storylines planned for, for Paige that sort of reverberate out there. So we're going to see each of them, you know, 
chewing on things that we really haven't seen them before. You know, Walter we've seen, we've seen a lot of his stuff. And I think this year, you know, we went through two seasons of that and I think that we can really do some there's there's a lot more material to be mined from the other from the other cast who are who are great. And we've seen them do it in little pieces and we can I think we can have a lot we're gonna have a lot more fun with everybody else this year. So the dynamic will be tortured at times, very friendly at times, but they always come back together at the end. There's always there's gonna be a lot of a lot of craziness with them, they're always fun together. You know, I always sort of look at the things that really surprised me. I never knew Robert Patrick could be so funny. And Robert Patrick could be really funny. He has such amazing timing. And you just don't expect that face to be able to go. And he does that. He did that one moment where, and I can't remember what episode it was. It was the building episode. It was 206 last year. And the building was coming around. Paige was, you know, talking about some girl that Walter had been flirting with who ended up roofing, and, and, he, and she mouthed at me and was like, he gave some response about her, and he was like, and it was, I just, I was like, wow, that was phenomenal. Um, so that was one thing, I think, I just, you know, and I think we see that with each one of these actors. They have great, you know, we, we go to them for action, we go to them for comedy, a lot. And what they've proven time and again is how uh, is how deep they can be, is how much soul they can bring to it. And that to me is, has always been, you know, when we when we've given them the material, they've always risen to it, and that has been that's been phenomenal. And, and I think that's what's involved in us to like give them more, give them more character stuff. Don't pull back on it. You know, everybody can do it. Let's see everybody do it. You know, it makes the episodes richer. And more. Guys, thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah, I feel like we just.